Dr. Vikram Sathav. I'm a consultant, uh, urologist and transplant surgeon in D.Y. Patel Hospital. I've been working in this hospital since about 16 years now. We have been running a transplant program since the last 7 to 8 years. We've done almost above 100 transplants at D.Y. Patel Hospital. We have a regular, dedicated and one of the state-of-the-art hospital OTs which are available for transplant. And our cadaveric transplant program, which is one of the uh, significant uh, transplant centers in Pune, wherein round the clock we are available for retrieval as well as transplant, cadaveric transplants regularly. We have about 20 odd cases which we have done in the past four to five years and have excellent results. Our hospital has a dedicated ICU. We have uh, infrastructure wherein high risk patients and complicated patients are treated on a regular basis. What happens in the cadaveric transplants as we all know is when a, there is a brain dead individual wherein his brain activity is not there but his heart and lung and other organs are normal. The patient is counseled regarding or the relatives are counseled regarding transplant or donor uh, donating his organs for next patients who are requiring transplant. There are significant amount of patients of kidney failure who require transplant but the live related transplants or live related donors the availability number is less. These patients will go on to the transplant list which is maintained by the ZTCC. Once the donor is available, a healthy donor whose other organs are normal and his relatives are willing for donation of organs, the body is maintained in a very uh, good homeostasis wherein the circulation for all the organs is maintained. These patients or these donors actually can give multiple organs to various individuals and almost about 7 to 8 individuals can benefit from this organ donation like the lung, the heart, there are two kidneys, pancreas and multiple organs, sometimes intestines also can be transplanted. At our institute, we have been doing about cadaveric transplants on a regular basis and the success at our institute has been 95%. We have a dedicated urology team and a vascular team which is available 24 hours a day for the transplant requirements. The patient, once he's we prepared, cross-matched with the donor and is ready for transplant. Other than is uh, received, the organ is well perfused. We have case instances wherein the organ was available in Sholapur and has been transplanted to or has been transported through the green corridor to D.Y. Patil Hospital and we have conducted the transplant here. In fact, one of the organs which uh, we have the kidney which was available for from the donor in our hospital was transferred to transported to Solapur and from there they did, did a trivial transplant there. At our institute we are regularly getting kidneys uh, from Aurangabad, Mumbai wherein the, the donor is from our list and from our hospital and we are conducting on a regular basis the cadaveric transplants. We have a dedicated uh, transplant team which is available 24 hours a day. We also have uh, social workers and counsellors who are available. So if any queries regarding cadaveric transplant or any uh, questions you have any regarding cadaveric transplants, you are always welcome at DY Patil Hospital. And we will. Sh I hope that we can help you out uh, to improve your patient's condition and make him live a better, better and a healthier life. Thank you.